Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Simply Nerdy. This is Anthony hosting once again. Uh, in fact, this whole thing has been a continuous recording, and we've just been splitting here. So I've been hosting this whole time. <laughs> right now, now that we've gotten the big, big two of, you know, the highlights for us out of the way, we wanted to make sure we discussed the remaining games that kind of made an impression. And so I'm, we're going to make this more of a highlight reel and go through just all the things that that we saw that we were excited about. This one isn't one for me, but Overcooked Cars Edition is coming, apparently. Yes, it is! <laughs> are Steven you, was not pleased. Steve? I am a fan of it now. It took me okay. a little bit. Anth- or St- <laughs> yeah, Steven was mad because it wasn't Overcooked. Team three. 17, listen here, Team 17. You are good at Overcooked. Stop trying to do other things. Uh, anyway. but they want to no. branch out. <laughs> I was just going to say that Stephen was very displeased in the chat, and mm-hmm. Anthony and I, who are um, overcooked heathens, were both confused because we were like, "This is, this is overcooked, yeah. just different. It seems the same to us <laughs> <laughs> as far as now." <laughs> so, uh, uh, yeah, Hopefully it's a tad Stephen different. But like I, 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 I have since come around, but it, it's tad different. This game uh, looks like a more promising title that will scratch my Overcooked 3 itch. We'll see. I'm excited for it. We'll see. I'm, I'm definitely going to pick this one up. And uh, where's Overcooked 3? Let's see where that is. <laughs> <laughs> so zipping through a few more of these, the next one that I'm super excited for is Sonic Superstars. Yeah, it's Sonic Superstars! It kind of seems like... Uh, Sega finally took a, took a hint from the success of Sonic Mania, Mania and said, yep. "Hey, let's let's do that." Yep. So, yeah, but it, it looks it, so it, much better. The great art it, style looks so good. Yeah, it, yeah. it looks a lot of fun. It, it looks like the Sonic as as I remember it as a kid. So yes, you know, very excited for that one. I might, I might play it, but what if there's a water level? There definitely. There's is. always a water levels. There's <laughs> always going to be I don't a water know level. If I can play in those conditions. <laughs> <laughs> Something I love though is the four player co op. And... Oh man! I hope it's real co op. I hope it's real because uh, it is the first time they've done four player. But in the past, they've had two player, and the second player like gets left in the dust all the time. Yep. So. I yeah. am worried on how they're going to do it. That, that, that was my last point, is I'm worried how yeah. they're going to handle the speed of everyone. But also, I wanted to say, I hope they handle it like new Super Mario Bros. You can just bash into each other and mess each other up. What? Is Wait. It, you do what that? Really? I do. Stephen never said he didn't like I'm just that, kidding. though. I didn't. <laughs> I never said I did. I never said I didn't. Uh-huh. I said it was a feature. Of the new Super Mario Bros. games. <laughs> you know, you know, what you're saying is Kevin is a troll, and so he would, he would enjoy that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the Hidden Treasure of Area Zero DLC for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet? Nope. No. Uh, I that... have the game, but I haven't opened it. <laughs> if you do, it'll glitch. I just get... <laughs> that one did look a little bit more interesting to me. I yeah. I still don't know if I'm going to get the game. I, I want to know if they're going to, or if they, you know, if they already have started fixing up some of the, the game's more egregious problems. It's a feature, Anthony. It's a feature now. It really is a feature now. <laughs> and let us know down in the comments below if those uh, issues have been fixed so we can maybe pick up the game. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, honestly, I was, I was pretty excited about the game until I realized that it wasn't really finished. So. Same. I Gee. was... 100% gonna get it day one until the glitches. I'm intrigued, and I'll leave it at that. Okay, done. So, moving up from there, uh, the next one on the list is Palea. Yep. All right. That's the, the like, MMO <laughs> farm sim slash hunting game. I don't know how deep those systems are gonna go. All of it and, pass. Uh, farm sims are usually kind of not, well, they're not my thing, really. Not but even yeah, Animal Crossing. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah, that's that's for you, Steve. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I I do enjoy Stardew Valley on occasion. So sure, I do enjoy my farming simulators from now and again. But uh, I've, I've had yeah, I have Stardew Valley. I have Animal Crossing. I know Animal Crossing is not really a farming simulator, but it's like a life simulator. So I I've got my simulators. I'm good. And that right there, in a nutshell, is why I'm not an Animal Crossing. I so, don't want to play life. <laughs> 
Why am I already living it? <laughs> you you made Steven get back here. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm just saying, Palea, I it, it doesn't seem like it's my style, but it, it is a curiosity. So, there you moving go. on from that, next on the list is Persona 5 Tur- uh, Tactica. I, I have Brad. not really gotten into any of the persona games i know that they're they're uh highly acclaimed highly Highly beloved yes that's a good way of putting it um i have realized that i am actually a major fan of tactical rpgs so yes i'm I'm intrigued by that but i just don't know if it's ever going to fit into my back (laughs) there's too many you know higher up on the list games so we'll see but it looks it looks like it could be cool and that logo Whoever was the graphic designer for that needs a raise. Next up, kind of a dark horse for me, Myth Force. I am actually really interested in that game. Ooh, that kind of sounds, I'm not. Yeah, Tell me why. You're not. Tell me why. Did you watch Saturday morning cartoons as a kid? Of Dude. course, of course I did, but that <laughs> sound weird. Like, what is going oh, on? Stop it. Okay, so the Saturday morning cartoons <laughs> going thing up. was already just kind of like, oh wow, nostalgia kind of smack in the face there again you know co-op rpg style type of game though those are a pretty good combination for me it just looks like it could have a lot of fun personality and and it looks like a game that could be solid to play with friends so did you guys notice the nod to he-man uh no. i feel like I, I remember yeah he said something like the the power of by the power of and friendship or something they didn't, they didn't say gray skull but they you know yeah, no, no, no. I oh, there you go. Oh, good there you job, go. You guys. Hey, good woo-hoo. job. You guys know what you're doing. <laughs> hey, I can give you credit, though. Yeah, seriously. Maybe I'll have to look into this. I don't know. I I am. Uh, I would be interested in playing it with others, but I would not buy it yeah. just if nobody would play it with me. Anyway, so next, uh, this one's for you, Steve. Yes, it is. The, the Splatfest. The Splatfest! Team Strawberry all the way. So, Strawberry right over here. Uh, Simply Nerdy is going to live stream it, so I'll be watching for that. And what the heck, Nintendo, you can't announce a new Froggy Notion mode and then not show anything. Rude. Rude. I was, okay. I have to be honest about this one. I was surprised that they didn't talk about the DLC more. So That too! I was proud about a, that. You're right. Nintendo Direct. I was surprised they used the time in a Nintendo Direct to just announce a spot fest. Yeah, that is weird. They could have yeah, done that in like a post, but you are absolutely right. What the heck? Yeah, I'm not sure why they even give that airing time, but oh, whatever. Else? I, I will mean, take it. I'm a Splatoon guy. I love it. Give me all the Splatoon you want, but still, that is weird. Next one, Detective Pikachu Return. Great <laughs> news for tons of fans of the franchise. That's I'm correct. so yes. happy for all of you. Woo! <laughs> great, great win for all y'all. <laughs> yep. It's, no, it, it you've been waiting like for that. The first game has some very dedicated fans. So. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Well, and that's very that a movie got fans. made, so. Yeah, no. And I like the movie. The movie was good. I own that movie. Wow. I actually liked it. It was really good. All okay. right. So, uh... We've, we've done it again. We're very verbose. <laughs> We're going to split this off. Until I say keep it dirty? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? Subscribe and like. <laughs> yeah. Oh, keep it dirty. Here we go. <laughs> wait, wait. Uh, do the micro micro machines voice. Yeah, until next time, keep it dirty. Tell us what you think in the comments, and please subscribe and like and um, uh, say things at us, and goodbye. Keep, keep it dirty. dirty.